aftermarket review is of the T-55 main battle tank uh, from uh, the USSR. It's a 135th scale model by Lindbergh. And uh, there's one picture of the finished model. It says it has some parts for the Israeli Tehran 5. So, uh, more information here. And let's look on the back here. It has some details here about the tank. And a picture of the uh, finished model. Looks like it's unpainted there. And uh, some more pictures there with some close ups. So, I'm not usually a fan of Lindbergh, uh, it's a very old model line. And their kits are usually um, old and have uh, not a lot of detail, not very well made. But this one looks like it's reasonable, so we yeah, have a look at it. Here's some uh, vinyl treads. They're sort of soft and pliable. And we've got the two of them, as well as our little uh, rings here for going to go on the wheels. And then these two will get uh, put together like that. And then you melt them together. So that's those. So let's have a look at our screws here. So first of all here, it looks like we have some uh, barrels here. Here's the... Uh, bottom of the gun turret. Here is our actual turret. We do have some mold lines here, I can see there. And a little bit of flashing, this is all irrelevant though. Looks like there's another gun, the base of the gun turret, smaller gun here. And another uh, Main gun there, got some fuel tanks and some uh, body parts here. Here's another gun and the other gun. Over here we have all our wheels, reasonable detail there. And then here are the axles. This part's already come off, see, so made by round two. I've taken all the old molds and started reproducing them. So we have some flashing here. This is the uh, base of the body here. Here's our turret. It's got some detail on there. And there's the uh, grill. And yeah, this is the uh, side of the tank here. And then we have our cogs for the wheels. And a uh, fair amount of little parts. And here we have our decals. So it looks like probably uh, two options there. Let's have a look at our instructions. Some details about the uh, tank. Looks so like first we build the uh, main body, put the wheels and axles on, and we build the uh, rest of the uh, body parts together. Add some details, put some uh, tanks, there's probably gas tanks, we build our main turret and that gets mounted here's a slightly different version, this is the uh, Israeli version and it's a little different not, not too different but uh, some differences, let's have a look here Adding the guns on the turret, and then finally everything is mounted. Shows you how to put the uh, tracks together, and then uh, those 
those are the uh, T-55 versions for East Germany, Russia, that's the Israeli version. So, all in all, reasonable level of detail, not as bad as some of the other Lindbergh models, and a fair number of parts and some reasonable decals.